it is a time-honored tradition in professional sports. When teams match up in the postseason, oftentimes local government officials will engage in a friendly wager on the outcome of the game or the series. And, well, Toledo and Cincinnati have joined that tradition as the mayors of the two respective cities are, well, they're, they're wagering hot dogs. You see, if Toledo should win, well, then you're going to get some Cincinnati Gold, style, Gold Star Chili Coney dogs sent up north. If the unthinkable happens and the Cyclones are victorious, well, Wade Kapsikevich is sending some Tony Paco's dogs down here to Cincinnati. So the question is, Paco's or Coney dogs? I'm going to go with uh, Tony Paco's. No questions Tony asked. Paco's. Uh, Tony Paco's all the way. Tony Paco's. Tony Paco's, but I'm not a hot dog person, so. <laughs> what makes Cincinnati chili so special? Uh, the taste and flavor of the uh, meat sauce. And the cheese. The sauce. <laughs> it's something that I got used to when I moved here back in 1984. And it's a flavor that I always liked. What is it about Paco's that is special? Well, I think it's just a local flavor and it's been around so long that, uh, yeah, all the, all the local people love it. Paco's has a kind of a homegrown story to it. It's from Toledo, it's from the area. The original one was on Front Street there in Toledo. Skyline's kind of a franchise, Tony Paco's not. Or Skyline or Gold Star? Well, I'm a Skyline fan. <laughs> but when you grow up in Cincinnati, you get you used to it at a very young age. When you grow up in Cincinnati, is it set in stone that you're a Gold Star or a Skyline, or can you go back and forth? You can go back and forth, but I like Skyline better.